Welcome everybody, I'm Fabio Viviani and this is Fabio's Kitchen where every week I'm bringing you a simple dish made by me. Today on Fabio's Kitchen we are making one of my favorite seafood dishes in a format of crostini. We're gonna make chopino but then we're gonna add a lot of crusty bread underneath so that will soak the juice and be fantastic. Crostino ai frutti di mare con le vongole, le cozze, i calamari, i gamberi. E poi cosa facciamo? Ci mettiamo il pane sotto, che si assorbe. First and foremost, we are going to add some extra virgin olive oil to two hot pan. Olio d'oliva in due padelle separate. A little bit of garlic, podaglio, and a little bit of garlic. In one, we're gonna start the base for the calamari, shrimp, and uh, scallops. In the other one, we're gonna open the shellfish. Clam and mussel, cozze vongole. The garlic starts to caramelize a little bit, see that? There. Little bit of white wine. Vino bianco per sfumentare cozze vongole e si lascia chiuso. Right here, I'm gonna roast some garlic, add a little bit of chili flakes, a little bit of onion, cipolla, un po' di peperoncino, pomodoro fresco, fresh tomato, onion, garlic, and chili flakes. We're gonna cook these for very short, guys. Very short. One to two minutes. Un minuto, due, e la base per i gamberi, i calamari, e queste capesante. Come si? What's the name of this in Italian, Nick? Fuck, do you know, anyway. This is capesante. I think it's capesante, capesante. yes. Capesante, calamari e gamberi, scallops, calamari, and shrimp goes into the onion, tomato, and garlic. Now we're opening here, clam and mussel. Here's what we're gonna do. So the calamari is the hardest. Will take a little longer to cook. But we're talking about just minutes. So we're gonna wait 30 seconds and then we're going to add the, the shrimp. Salt and pepper, sale e pepe. Shrimps. Scallops. Calamari, gamberi e capesante. Turn the fire higher. Un altro po' d'olio extravergine di oliva. A little bit more extravergine olive oil. Look how nice and coated this becoming. When the calamari is getting nice and white, and when the shrimp will be nice and pink, this is done. Quando il gambero diventa bello rosa e il calamaro bello bianco, siamo pronti. Scallops cooks very quickly. Once the other two are ready, you'll be fine. Le capesante sono veloci da cucinare. Appena il gambero è cotto, capesante a posto. The reason why I'm cooking these separate is because clam and mussel takes a lot longer to open. You have to cook them separate because you don't want the, this overcooked or that. Li faccio cuocere separati perché le, le vongole e le cozze ci vuole di più a cuocerle dei calamari e dei gamberi, chiaramente. Now, I'm gonna put a little tomato, un po' di salsa di pomodoro, nelle cozze e nelle vongole. 
Sí. Pues de pronto, that's ready. Good chunk of parsley here. That's ready. Una, una bella manciata di prezzemolo fresco. Great, great addition. Lots of fresh parsley. Now I'm gonna let that reduce for a minute. And here's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna move this right here. I'm gonna get these to low. And I'm gonna toast my bread on the open fire there. It's gonna get a little burn, a little crispy. This, this bread is great for charring on the outside in this way. This bread will taste like you're grilling on the barbecue outside. Pane tostato, meraviglioso. That's how I heat up my tortilla at home. Perfect. The bread is nice and crisp. It's a little burn, but it's still nice and soft. I'm gonna sit it here for a second. And that's how we're gonna plate it now. Bread first, underneath like that. This goes on top. There. See, clam and maso has the nice juice underneath. As a good measure, if some shellfish doesn't open, don't use them. Calamaro, capesante gamberi sotto, cozze vongole sopra, clam and mussel on top. Now I'm gonna reduce the juices, a little extra. A little bit more parsley on it. Crostino delizioso ai frutti di mare. More extra virgin olive oil on it. Un bel piatto per la famiglia come centro tavola. Gorgeous. Seafood crostini, the bread is soaking. You have the idea of a chopin on top. It smells phenomenal. Clams, mussel, shrimps, capesante, scallops, calamari. Look at these gorgeous things right here. It's a perfect family dish for two. Takes no time to do. And because of the bread underneath, you're gonna love every bit of it. Check this out. Crostino e frutti di mare, cozze vongole, capesante, calamari. It's a quick dish, è veloce, questo piatto è veloce, è fuori di testa ragazzi. Questo è un piatto fenomenale, se siete con la fidanzata gli fate questo piatto, vi sposa, eh? ma che scherzi davvero, fenomenale. You're watching Fabio's Kitchen. Hey guys, now that you've watched, you know this is a good recipe. How about you go share it for once?